Hello my loves, today I'm going to be doing a haul and I have some clothing here. I also have a couple of other things. This is going to be a bit more of, not a high end haul I would say, but these pieces are a bit more substantial. I love really trendy items and if you actually saw last week, I hauled a bunch of stuff from Forever 21 and Wet Seal Plus and I will link that down below and at the end of this video if you want to watch it. None of this is really expensive. I know some of the pieces could have been but I got most of them on sale. Um, it's just, I don't know, more standout pieces, things that are going to last a really long time instead of being super trendy. So I'm going to go ahead and get into it. The first thing that I wanted to show you is this new purse from Betsy Johnson. I am so excited. I got this from Hot Look. It actually retailed for $78 and I got it for $40, no, $38 on sale. I'm sorry. I wanted it in cream and for some reason during the sale, the cream one was $10 more and the shipping cost like $7 instead of Four. Uh, so I was like, I'll just get, I'm really cheap. This shows how cheap I am. So I just got black. I don't really own any black purses, so I thought it'd be kind of fun. Um, I haven't even used it yet, but you can see it's super duper roomy. Um, I'll take out the stuffing so you actually can see that. It has so much room. I love the lining, and I think that it's going to be really nice. I like the chain, and honestly, it doesn't feel even like a slightly lower end um, bag would. It feels every bit as nice as like my coach bags and my Michael Kors purse. Um, so I'm really excited. I really love Betsy Johnson and I haven't had a new item from her in a really long time. So I was excited to get a new baby. You are so darn cute, aren't you? It's funny because I didn't actually know if this item was going to make it in the haul and it was just delivered today to my doorstep. This is from Wild Fox and it is a gorgeous baggy beach jumper. I got it in this really beautiful mint um, with a pink moon on it and I couldn't decide between this and like a neutral one but honestly mint is one of my favorite colors. Um, I love pastels and I just really thought that this felt right up my alley and this was only $40 during the sale. It retailed for, I don't even know, I have the tag here, but probably like over a hundred. I got the size large by the way and the only reason I knew that was I tr I've tried them on so many times at like Nordstrom and Saks um, and just never got it. So so then actually this brand saw that I mentioned them in a Gwynny B haul and I'm going to get into some Gwynny B stuff that I uh, rented here recently. I have so much stuff from them and I don't want to haul all of it. I just wanted to show you a few pieces that are out. Um, but this brand called Sealed with a Kiss saw that I hauled one of their dresses and they were like, hey, is there anything that you want to style and maybe we can do a lookbook together? Now that it's here, I can tell it's all extremely well made, as was that dress. Um, it is actually an adult uh, plus size line as opposed to a teen plus size line. So their sizing is going to run slightly larger. This first top is really beautiful. It's like a black, um, not sheer, but... <sighs> I don't know how you would even explain it. It's not the most opaque thing, but it's definitely not sheer either. At the bottom here, it has kind of this mint detail, and I thought this was so cute in a really easy way to wear a darker color for fall. If you're like me and you wear pastels a lot and really girly things a lot, it's kind of hard to transition into edgier pieces, especially for fall. But I really liked that, and I thought it was super cute. My friend Sarah owns it in the... what is it? Um like coral color and it's really really cute. I also picked up this dress and it is this really really beautiful maroon color. I'm having a hard time holding it up. It's like a maroon skater style dress and it has short sleeves, cinches in at the waist and flares out. This is a little bit large and I got the smallest size which is a 1x. I will definitely say it's a little bit baggy in the waist. Um, a little bit loose where I wish it was tighter, but it is really cute and I think that as long as you have a cute belt to go with it, it's adorable and golden and you need it. Speaking of dresses, I also got this really cool maxi dress. I thought that this could be really fun um, for like, not Halloween, but I feel like I don't know, October is an excuse to be kind of vampy and witchy, and I really loved this maxi dress. If you can see, it's like a baby doll cut, cinches in at the boobs, and just flows out, and it has three quarter, maybe, no, I can't find anything. It has half sleeves, I'm sorry, and I really thought this would be cute, and it would be easy to dress up or dress down, and I, you know, you always need another black maxi in your life. A few more things, I first have this dress, and this was so exciting, I love it so much. It is this floral mint dress, and oh, I love it. Again, 1X, and it is so, so freaking cute. Kind of same fit as the last one, um, a little bit lower on the waist, though. By the way, Sealed with a Kiss carries up to a size 36, so um, you can find 
a lot of different sizes and pieces there. I really love this and I think it's going to not only be cute right now but also be really cute into the spring. The last thing that I got from them is this jacket and I haven't actually tried this on I will admit. Um, it is a blue jean jacket and I like the rinse of it a lot. I kind of wish I had gotten a lighter one but I chose this darker one especially for fall. I thought it would be cute and you can see it just buttons. It feels really stretchy as well. I really like the way that this looks though, um, and I just can imagine styling it with everything. To finish off the haul, I have some Gwynnie B things here to show you. Um, if you don't know, Gwynnie B is almost like a clothing rental service. You pay a certain fee per month. This is not everything I got this month. Um, Gwynnie B is not a sponsor or anything. It's just something that I pay for every month and I've always really liked. The first thing I thought I would talk about, because I wore this, to something with my husband um, and I actually filmed an outfit of the day that night but it is this dress from BB Dakota and this is something that I'm going to purchase I got this in a size uh, where are you 14 and it fits like a dream just looks beautiful on it, it has this low neck um, super retro super freaking beautiful then I got this really cute dress which is inside out and it's weird I haven't even worn it um, it is a little animal print dress and I thought this was so cute for fall especially with a jean jacket like I showed you earlier this is from the brand Flutter and it's a size 14. It has a little Peter Pan collar, it cinches in at the waist, has a little tie here in the back and it's so cute, fits really well and I just thought this was so adorable for fall. One more dress I thought I'd show you is more of a retro piece and it's from the brand Hellbunny. I love the little collar right here, I love the button details and I love the print so much. I cannot figure out what I want to wear this to um, but I need to before the snow starts and I just you know can't anymore. It also has a halter tie too. Adorable dress. I really like this skirt, especially for the fall season, because it has this really beautiful, like, coral color underneath, and it's super poppy, but then it has the white flowers on top, and I just really liked this. I liked the way that it fit in the waist. I liked the way um, that it hit at the knees, and it's a really, really cute little skirt. I can't imagine um, this not working for so many different people. One of my favorite things that I got this time around is this black top, and I cannot find the neck of this first off, but I also cannot get over how beautiful this is. It is from the brand Mint 1792, and I love it. It has this little bit of leather detail up here. In the front, it's plain, and then in the back, it's like pleated. So it's really, really unique, and I really like it. I want to style this so many different ways. Maybe I'll do like a lookbook just featuring this top and showing you how to style it because it is adorable. The last Gwynnie B piece I wanted to show you is this cardigan which I can't seem to get right. Um, I love this. This is the warmest baggiest cardigan ever. If you like big baggy warm cardigans definitely check out Gwynnie B's selection. They've got so many and again you can rent them. I really like the um, design on this one. I love like the crosses and then the zigzag and then you know it's just really freaking cute and it will go with absolutely everything. This is I don't know what brand this is from. I can't seem to ever find the tag. Oh, BB Dakota 1X. I love BB Dakota. They always seem to do good things for me. So that is my haul. If you did not check out part one, make sure to do that at the end of this video. There will be a link as well as down below. Give it a thumbs up if you did enjoy. Subscribe to my channel if you have not already. And until next time, I love you so very much and I will see you in the next video.